everybody, it's Susie. Welcome to my craft room. I have two huge pieces of happy mail, and these are from my precious friend Cynthia. Um, I have not opened them, uh, I've had them five days, and it's been about to drive me crazy to get them opened up, but I didn't want to do it off camera. And as y'all know, with my health issues and things, I haven't been able to, um, to really film like I wanted to, uh, it, there's been a few other little issues, but, um, anyway, I'm so excited to finally get to open these. Y'all just don't even know, uh, this, this lady is so, so precious. Y'all, y'all cannot imagine what a great friend she's been to me. She checks on me all the time. Um, you know, she sends me emails and such. And I just, I appreciate her love and support more than you could possibly know. Uh, you know, you just could have never, I, I just, I don't know. I, I could have never imagined how amazing and awesome this community of crafters is. Um, and, you know, I've got two ladies who continuously check on me and they are true 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 servants of the lord and they um they're just wonderful and i just i can't thank them enough and cynthia you have spoiled me i don't have a clue what's in these but let's find out because i have been chomping it to bit uh oh i don't want to cut anything let's get into the tape doesn't look like the post office was too kind to my box. I hope they didn't mess anything up. All right, I'm going to have to take this off. I'm going to have to move it so that y'all don't see this name and address on here. I'm going to share that. Ooh, I don't know what that is, but it sure is pretty. What is that? Ooh, look at this, y'all. Oh! <gasps> Look at that lace, would you? Oh, my word. Oh, my word. Oh, that is absolutely stunning. Look at those colors. Oh, my. Okay, I know exactly a project that I'm going to use that on. Wow, that is beautiful. Oh, my God, Cynthia. I don't know where you found that, but it is, that is gorgeous. What is this? What is this? What is, oh, some of these. Texture boutique. What is that? Uh-oh, there's more stuff in the bottom. What is this? Sizzix texture. <gasps> is this a embossing machine? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Wait, I don't know. See, I don't know the difference between an embosser or a cutter. I'm going to have to look this up. I'm going to have to look this up. Isn't that adorable? Y'all look at that. It looks like a little purse. Oh my word. Is Oh my word. Is that so adorable? I love that. Cynthia. Oh my God. I don't know what it really is, but I'm going to find out. Oh, thank you. Thank you. Oh, look at these beautiful index cards. Look at those colors. Aren't those vibrant? Wow. 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 And these feel like those are the thick kind, too. I like those. Thank you. Thank you. More index cards. Yeah. Can't we always use those? And you know what? I, I do use these in my journals, but... I use them mostly because I write down ideas and such on them. And then I have my little file box that actually fell in the floor this morning. But I keep them in my little file box. You know, those. some of y'all remember the old-timey, you know, like little metal file boxes that, you know, you'd keep your index cards in, like recipes and stuff. Well, that's what I use. And as I come up with different ideas or a different technique, I write them down so that I can try to remember to do them later with y'all. Oh, look, frames. Oh, some of them are the um, rectangular shape, and some of them are the round shape. Oh, my God, I love those. And I I didn't have any frames like this at all. So, thank you, thank you. You know what? I want to I wanna open them up because, like I said, I don't have any like this either. 
I can't wait to find out what that is. I don't have anything like it, so I wouldn't know. Ugh. Wow, that's like a cardstock, y'all. That is really, really sweet. Thank you, thank you, Cynthia. I love these. I absolutely love, love, love these. So I can't wait to use those. Oh, look at this beautiful butterfly fabric. Cynthia, I want to know if you sew, because you have some beautiful fabrics. Look how that matches. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh, wow. I love, love, love that. <gasps> Look. Isn't this fun? Isn't this fun? Oh, I love it. Like little uh, quilted patchwork hearts with the little buttons. Isn't that adorable? I love that. And I love hearts. Oh, thank you, Cynthia. I love it. <gasps> oh, my. Uh-oh. This is wrapped around stuff. Don't mess up, Susie. Oh, look. Here's some more of that beautiful fabric. More lace. Isn't that beautiful? Wow. Wow. Oh, I love, love, love that. Look at this lace, would y'all? Oh, my. Wow. Wow. It's an old curtain panel. Look at that. Oh my God, is that gorgeous? Wow. I mean, this could be cut as a border for a page. Each one of these elements, I mean, that could be cut and then that taken out just as a frame around something. And then this right here, you know what I saw? Uh, I believe it, y'all probably can't see that because of the white. Let me see. Can y'all see that? Um, I believe it was Charlotte Peterson that was showing where you have a hole like in the card, or I guess it's two thicknesses, and this would go between, and you would have a hole, and this would go between the two thicknesses, and then you have that texture in there, and it looked really cool. So I think that's a great idea. I also think that would be a great idea for this part too. But look, I mean, there's so many different elements in this that you could use together or separately. I mean, just beautiful. Look at these. Isn't that gorgeous? Oh my God. Cynthia, you have spoiled me. Oh my word. I can't thank you enough. Wow. Wow, thank you, thank you. Oh, look. Look, she made me a... Um... A paper ruffle with some of the most gorgeous paper. Isn't that beautiful? Look how much of it she made. Wow, Cynthia, thank you. Oh, my God. I'm going to put some of that in my personal journal. Yes, yes, yes. Oh, my God, I love it. I'm going to smash that. Let's see. Oh, these are cut together. May, let's see, die cutter. May, may, made it. And you can too. I'm confused. Are these dies? They look like stamps. Thankful, grateful, blessed for your kindness for your family when I thought of you today. How nice, y'all. Oh, my God. Oh, look. I guess these go with this. They fit in there. Oh, my word. So this is dies. So this is a die cutting machine. Oh my God, I can't wait to see how to use it. Is that so cool? Wow. I love that. Oh my word, I cannot wait to play with this. Oh, my gosh. Thank you, Cynthia. Look, y'all. More. Oh, now, that would be pretty like I was talking about, you know, like in between those cards like that. Look at this. That is awesome. Look at that. I love this. 
Oh, my word. Oh, here we go. What have we got here? More stamps. Look. Hope your day is amazing. You're a whole bouquet of wonderful. Yes, Cynthia, you are. You are more than a bouquet of wonderful. Everyone needs a friend like you. They sure do. Wow. Aren't those beautiful? Wow. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Oh, look. Look, there's some little butterfly dies in there and stamps. Little ladybug, some butterflies, a little flower, get well, best wishes, Father's Day, birthday, happy, God bless, Mother's Day, congratulations on your... Isn't that cool? I love that. Oh, and that shows the the butterfly coming up from the card. That is cool. That is so cool. Wow. Thank you, thank you, thank you, Cynthia. Oh, my word. And then a bag. Does that go in there? Oh, nope, I guess not. But I can always use those. And then look, ribbon to match. The fabrics. Look at that. Look at, I mean, how thoughtful is that? How abs and look, this even matches that. I mean, this is so well thought out, thought out, Cynthia. I just, I can't even tell you how touched I am. I mean, you have spoiled me beyond belief. Oh my word! I, I just don't even know how to adequately thank you. I mean, I, I feel. So loved, so honored that you would think of me like this. Oh my God, what can I possibly do for you? Oh my word. Thank you, Jesus. Okay, let me open this one. Be careful not to show that address. I think I could safely cut that without cutting anything. Ooh, there's something close. Just, girl, I don't think you could have got anything else in this envelope. Stamp first. What's that say? Stamp first, cut second. Oh, my goodness, look. Oh, my. Oh, that is the flower part. This is the big part of the flower. So, I guess these come apart. And so, you stamp it, and then you put the cutter on it. Beautiful. You're the bee's knees. Best buds. Lovely. How neat. Look. Some bees. Flower parts. Hi. Hello. Little ladybugs. Isn't that amazing, y'all? Embossing folder. Oh, it is an embosser. Cool. So I will definitely have to look up how to use this. I'm so excited. I am so excited. So you stamp and cut the same. I love that. Oh, my word. Look at here. Here's the directions. She must have known that I'm like stupid. I didn't mean that, Cynthia. I didn't think you thought I was stupid. I knew you would never think that of me, but I just, I've never had anything like this. So I had no clue how to do it. So now I do. So guess what I'm going to be playing with later on, y'all? Thank you, Cynthia. Oh, my word. Happy birthday to you. That butterflies? Oh, it is. It is. That, oh, I guess you put paper or card in there and then run it through. I'm going to read. I'll know in a little bit. Oh, my God. Cynthia, I am so spoiled. The Blue Barn. 
80 sheet cardstock. <gasps> Look. This will fit in those, won't it? They're pretty close. Oh, my word. Look how beautiful these papers are, y'all. I've never seen these little books. Cynthia, do you get these locally or you get them online? I've never even seen these little books of cardstock. These papers are awesome. Isn't that gorgeous? That looks kind of like the old-timey wallpapers, doesn't it? I love that. Oh, what's that called? Ticking? Oh, my goodness. Look at there. The buffalo check. Plaid. Let's see. Buffalo. Plaid check. Buffalo check. Y'all know what I'm talking about. Oh, look. Isn't that cute? The little drawers. I love that. Isn't that gorgeous? The roosters. And you know what? I'm in Gamecock country, so that's talking my tune. And the cows. I love it. Love it. Love it. Love it. I love the blue. The blue. The blue. The, that color. The blue buffalo plaid check. However it goes. Look at that. Isn't that pretty? I love that too. That'd make some nice pieces on recipe cards, wouldn't it? I love that. Oh, more Gamecocks. Wow, I'm telling you, that reminds me of old wallpaper, y'all. Look at that. Now, my grandmother had, like, wallpaper like that in her house. More Gamecocks. Wow, so neat. Now we know why it's called the barn. Farm animals. I love that. Thank you. What is this? Do not discard. Use the shim when embossing a single sheet of paper. Oh, I guess this is a shim. How neat. And this is embossing a folded card. Embossing a single sheet of cardstock. This is not a cutting surface. Okay, I'm definitely going to read the directions. Oh, here's another one. Ah, oh, I'm so excited about this. Wow, Cynthia, you have completely spoiled me. I, there's not enough thank yous. Uh, I am so overwhelmed by your love and your your generosity, you know, just your love, your compassion, your friendship has been more than enough. And this is way above and beyond. I mean, I can't tell you how touched that I am. There's no possible way I could even come close to expressing how appreciative I am. Obviously, I, you know, couldn't afford anything like this. And it's things that I've looked at, but, you know, being on a fixed income, it gets tough to to make ends meet sometimes. Well, actually, I, I do okay making my ends meet. I've learned to live within my budget and um, to do that. But, you know, to have any of the extras, you have to save, you know, just little bits for a long period of time. And, uh, you know, there were things that, that I wanted or even needed more. And so that is like a luxury item that I could not have, have gotten and probably would not have gotten. And so it, I can't imagine how much money you tied up in that for me and your kindness, your generosity, your love is overwhelming uh, I hope that I can inspire you I hope that there's something that I can do for you um, you are truly truly a gem among friends uh, and I thank you with all of my heart I'm trying really hard not to cry um, 
I'm so touched. I, I just, um, I'm at a loss for words. Thank you. Thank you so very much. You have spoiled me beyond belief. So much more than I deserve. And I just thank you for your kindness. Everybody, I pray that the Lord will send you somebody in your life that has touched you as much as Cynthia's touched me. Her emails, her encouragements on my comments. Uh, and then to spoil me the way that she has is just... I, I, I just don't even know how to express my deepest appreciation. Uh, I'm so grateful. And Cynthia, know that I pray for you every day. I pray for all my YouTube uh, friends. Uh, but you, your name specifically is on my prayer list. And... I lift you up all the time uh, <coughs> in my prayers to the Lord and asking that he continually surround you with his love and protection and that he blesses you in a mighty way. Again, thank you. Uh, thank you from the bottom of my heart. Okay, y'all. I am... Um, I pray that y'all have been somewhat as blessed by this as I have. Uh, I'm touched beyond words. I look forward to seeing y'all tomorrow. Y'all take care. Blessings and hugs to everybody. All right. Bye-bye.